Hello everyone. So today we'll be looking at uh, some powerful open source model such as Falcon. The Falcon is more compared to OpenAI, ChatGPT 3.5. As we can see in the last language model leaderboard, after the GPT 3.5, the Falcon 40B instruct is there, which is an open source model. There are three variants of the Falcon, which is instruct, 40B parameter, and of 7B parameter, which is a small size. In this video, we will see how we can use this model to inference and also we'll integrate it with Langzen. So as of now, one limitation this model holds is is only trained on English and French data. As you can see in OpenAPI, ChatGPT, it is trained on multiple or multilingual data. So that's the problem. If you use it for the non-English, the result might not be accurate and there might be bias in the data set or model might lose in it. I might also make a video for fine tuning such LLMs for custom data set. So stay tuned. Now let's start with inference. Any model you see in Hugging Face can be inferenced. And if you are not sure about the tokenizer and a model imports, you can just use auto tokenizers and auto model for casual LLM. The simply you just have to pass the model name to auto tokenizer dot from pretend so how you can get model name if you want to use 7b parameter model then just go in the models and copy the tag similarly if you want to create use falcon 40b parameter models then you can just go in its models and copy its tag right here the things after that remain same this process can be used for any models in augie face the only thing you want to remember is if it is text generation models, summarization models, or any other model. So let's get back to the code. So in this video, we'll be using Falcon 7B instruct. Now, simply we pass the model to auto tokenizers. Also, we can use auto model for casual LMs to load the models. But pipeline provided by Hugging Face does all the hard work for us. You can simply pass the model name and tokenizer to the pipeline and it will do the rest of the work. Since in the early stage we have seen as Falcon 7B as text generation model, we will give a name such as text generations in the pipeline to set this work. Now after you run the cell, the model gets downloaded along with its tokenizers. You can see the model size is around 4GB and along with this other models variant such as 9.95 GB. Now this is quite big. Also if you select other models for summarizations, you simply have to change the text animations to summarization and the remaining things remain the same. Now comes the inference part. The pipeline we set above can be triggered by using a prompt or question you want to ask. So simply pass the prompt or your question to an pipeline and it will return an result from there. The main thing to understand here is the variable setup. The max length 50 means the total length of the result generated is of 50 character long and top k equals to 1 means it will generate only one probabilistic from all the result it compared in the model. Also remember that greater the length higher the inference time. So for now we'll just keep it for 50. Now, if you ask your model with a prompt of write a poem about Ronaldo in the nursery rhyme, it will generate something like There is a boy named Ronaldo whose talent for the score was sure to be stone. He kicked the ball with his feet and scored many goals. The length of the sequences generated can be increased if you just increase the max length to more. So let's use it with Langchain. If you have seen my previous video of Langchain for the PDF and website, there we have done information retrieval tasks. But here I want to show you something such as prompt base. In the earlier Langflow video, we have seen how to create a prototype for an LLMs. So let's borrow the concept from there. In the Langflow, there we use LLM chain, which required prompt and the model. So 
in the length chain in the chain section we can see LLM chain in the length chain also in the prompt we can see prompt template so the problem is solved let's import prompt template and LLM chain from the length chain since we have the pipeline set up already in our web the LLM becomes our pipeline in this case now we simply pass our template to the prompt template here template means prompt itself and in the LLM chain we pass prompt with LLM the LLM here is pipeline that we set up earlier if you want your model to behave little different and have diversity in the result you can just play around with the temperature here as of now I have set it to 0.01 so for an inference we can just write LLM chain dot run along with the question we provide so if you choose the template such as you are an intelligent chatbot here the question with a brilliant answer we can get results such as I am advanced chat language model I am proficient in several languages and converses screen size and many more this is what I want to show you today so to play around just change the temperature and you can get the result in case you want to use other open source model just copy the tag from the hogging face as I have shown above and now you can experiment with any LLM models of your choice there is a new model of red pajamas and other models you can try on also remember not every task you want to solve needs LLM small models can also do your work if fine tune on specific tasks so that's all for this video hope you learned something new if yes hit the like button and subscribe and if you have any question drop a comment would love to help thank you